everybody and welcome back to another episode of my decades challenge it's been a while since i have recorded my decades but as you can see we are traveling a prom with Catherine. and it's prom oh Catherine, why do you have your winter outfit on um we're gonna just switch up Catherine's outfit to her prom and let's see she needs to dance and vote for prom royalty who can she vote for daisy she's gonna vote for aunt daisy grab herself some fruit punch look at our girl she looks really nice and then maybe we could she could take a selfie with Daisy, even though Daisy don't have no hair on her head. Oh. I'm silly. I should have had her first um, take the picture, and then I should have had their pose. Okay. Oh, there we go. Switch orientation, and let's have it goofy. There we go, that looks cool. Let's get out a little, and let's do a happy one. Oh no, switch, change orientation. Okay, we'll just leave it like that. Let's take thoughtful. Look at them. And goofy. I'm trying to get a good picture. Let's do relax. There we go. That's a nice picture. You can see they related. Oh, there we go. Lovely pictures. And then who is this? Keenan Harris. Oh, you can say hi to Mr. Keenan. Oh. And then let us vote for our prom jester. How are we gonna vote for prom jester? We'll vote for Keenan. And then let us head over to go and get some dancing done. She looks so awesome. I just want to get a nice picture of her. Okay, I couldn't. There goes the dancing. Oh, they're having a ball. We're just going to ignore the guy with the, um, invite Daisy to dance. And then we can gossip. Let's see, do we have the gossip? We can gossip, we can gossip. Oh, the award is ceremony is starting. So let us let it go. Stop with the dancing. Let's get to the award ceremony. There we go. Right, let's listen to this award ceremony. This music's good. I mean, it's not the 60s, but it's still good. It still works. Okay, the principal might be pregnant. She's trying to throw up. All right. Let me see if I can cut down the music a little. There we go, just so that we don't have to hear the music so loud. We can focus on to see who is going to be nominated. Oh. Okay, who is going to be prom king or queen? And prom royalty and prom jester. Yay! It's the two that I said. That's awesome. Okay. 
that is real awesome and then we'll have a, I wanted to take some pictures of our old take a selfie because I think she looks really cool yes Miss Catherine you look absolutely cool and while we add it we need to see like how many days more does she have before she becomes an adult okay so she's still got a whole week left to go which is not bad But, okay, who is he? Freddy Mishram. Uh, don't know Freddy. Okay, let's leave Freddy alone. Let's congratulate. Uh, why can't I just have a congratulation? Let's see. Interest, affection, hip bump. I think prom is almost over anyway, so that's okay. Let's see. Let's brighten his day, and let us see what we think about him. So she's been having quite a bit of, I forgot his name, Keenan. She's been having quite a bit of fun with everyone. Unattractive. Okay. <laughs> what does she think of Calvin Reed? And prom is complete. Unattractive. So we're going to head off home, our girl is going to head off home, but before we do, let's get that picture. We are back home from prom, let's see how that treehouse is going, I think I got the treehouse at the back. Yes I do, they are almost done it, maybe they can continue the treehouse tomorrow, and let's see the food. Okay, it's still, I think it's still a few more minutes before. Okay, one hour left. So that's okay, she can have some food. He could come and eat some food as well. Before they all head off to bed. Oh, you need to eat some food too. Okay, and after she can clean up and then get off to bed because she had a good um, prom night. I think things went off well with her. Oh, let's see, use his bathroom, take a shower. You need to use the bathroom, so use your parents' bathroom, and then you can head off to sleep. Okay, Miss Shirley, let's turn off the TV, turn off the radio. And last but not least, Apollo, you can head right off to bed too. The Gibson household has had one good Halloween, and they had prom, and it's Sunday morning already. Oh, wow. So race spirits is fading away. There goes everybody off to bed. It's Sunday morning and as usual, Miss Shirley is the first awake. So we are going to have her fix some breakfast and let's make some pancakes because we had eggs and bacon the last time. But it's the first day of winter. Oh, I want to have him... After he takes his shower, he can come and repair this. Oh, why can't I fix it? Okay, repair. 
There goes our little boy. He's awake. He check up and feeds his mom. I just say good morning. He's inspired. Oh, that's lovely to have a child wake up and inspired. Quote his car to character. And he's also going to go about and say, Mom, you are my favorite. Where is he? Look at him. Look at the little booba. Brian Parsons. Okay, and when she wakes up, she is all asleep. Sound asleep in a slumber. Shirley is still busy trying to cook. Oh, she's made the pancakes. So call everyone to eat. Oh, let's forget about this. I thought you'd come and say hi to your mama. Well, let her call everyone to come and eat the pancakes. Why? Why is my game stuck? Come on, i got a day planned for you guys. That's a whole full. Okay, so everybody did not end up having breakfast together at the same time like I had planned. But breakfast was had. Um, once we completed with breakfast, then we are going to take a nice family trip. Let's put that away. And she can sit down and chat. Well, we're going to go and visit her oldest son, who is um, married to Apollo's sister. We're going to go and visit their household. Um, I forgot the name of the old... Athena. Athena and Jerry. We're going to go and visit their household. Who is Aubrey? Oh. So, okay, he's done eating. Apollo, did you finish eating? No. Oh, what are they doing? Oh, that's so nice. Look at them. They're having a whole romantic time. Oh, I gotta capture this. I gotta capture this. There we go. Let's press it and see. Oh, that is so nice. I had to capture that moment with a couple of pictures because that was absolutely romantic. Okay, so let's go and visit uh, Apollo's sister and Apollo and Apollo's sister Athena and Jerry. Just because I know that they have uh, kids. Okay, so it's just one, two. And is this the wife, Shirley? Okay, yes, it is. All right. Now, I kind of, I don't know if I remember where they live, so I'm going to have to uh, try to search for them. I know I moved them into a town. Um, well, that's, that's Apollo's mother's house. Who was that? That's a Gibson. And it's just going to circle and circle and circle, and I'm never going to know who. It's a brown. That's a walker. Okay, no, not you. So, I think they love it, wouldn't it, love, if I'm not mistaken. Aha, uh -huh, they do. Parsons. So, we got to go and see them. It's new skill day, so let us knock on the door and let's say hi. And come, you can say hi to your son. Oh, good, Mr. Jerry. Have a deep conversation. Oh, and let's go see. Oh, I see the babies. They are twins. Athena. Let's say hi to Athena. Give her a family kiss. And Thu's about some silly planning. And I'm trying to hard to just click and just let it just uh, hug lovingly. 
And let's go see the babies. So they have twins. Okay, this is Nakuera. Who is this baby? They want to show me the names? Courtney. This is Courtney. Okay. And Courtney, and this is Cadence. Oh, they're both so cute. Maybe we can feed Cadence. Help his mama out. I mean, her mama out. Oh, and we reached Catherine. You reached level 2 of parenting. That's awesome. Maybe she can build a snow pal. Build a snow pal with Jerry. There we go. Oh, she's rich. Oh, these babies. I forgot how much crying babies do. Oh, so I've had all three of them gain a skill. Uh, he ate already. So that's okay. Um, I guess there's not much for everybody to do. So everyone can head off home. At least we got to know the babies. We got to meet the babies. So if we ever have a family reunion in the future, we can invite the babies along as well when they become toddlers. We are back home. Shirley, you need to use the bathroom. And uh, Oh, he's playing some chess. Maybe we could go play chess with him. Why do we have a computer? Oh, we shouldn't even have a computer. Oh my god. I didn't even put a computer in there. Oh no, no, no. Go. I'm trying to think. I don't remember ever seeing a computer. Anyway, computer gone, evapor evaporated, out. This is the wrong era, wrong decade. We still got a few more decades to go. Let's go and build a treehouse. And Apollo, you can help your daughter build a treehouse. That could be your treat together, your bonding moment. Build in the treehouse for Brian to play in. Oh, she's reached handiness, handiness level number two. There we go. Oh, Doreen is calling. Let's see, Doreen. Remember when we talked about Jacob Salgado? We went on a very nice... Why are you going on a date? Alright. Well, that's okay. She can. I hope she don't have any more kids. Let me see. Because I know they have a lot. Her and Apollo's father had a lot of kids. So, Apollo was the oldest, and then came Dave. No, Apollo and then Athena. Hank, Desiree, Athena. Apollo and Athena. Then it's Daisy, and then Desiree and Hank. Oh, wow. So, one, two, three, four, five kids. And then Shirley is his wife. He has a stepson, Jerry, who's married to his sister. Um, Brian is a stepson. So, I wonder what the twins are. Granddaughter, granddaughter. But it's also <laughs> your sister's kids. Oh, wow. So, oh, that's, that's something. All right. Well, enough of that. We are busy building this treehouse. And let us go forward a little. Because I'd love to see it when it's completed. Maybe while we're doing that, we could get him a bike. To be outside playing the bike, riding the bike. 
or learning how to ride a bike. Because they had bikes in the 60s. Just realized I could have just clicked on the bike. And oh, the frustrations of having a slow computer. Let's see. We're going to buy in just this one. I kind of like that bike for little boys. Okay, so Ryan, come outside and practice riding your bike. Okay, while your stepdad and your stepsister build your tree house. We're going to fast forward this tree house because we need this tree house to be built. And with this, I am going to leave this episode off right here. Um, I hope you all enjoyed. I know it's a short episode, but there wasn't much to tell. It was the weekend. Um, Catherine did go to prom. Brian got a bike. They went to go and see the twins. Oh, they did kind of a little bit of stuff but like I said if you are enjoying this episode please give it a nice big thumbs up oh and the treehouse is complete a nice big thumbs up uh, do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not done so I appreciate all the support and I will see you all in the next episode ciao